So this time of year we don't need, um, the horses don't need a great deal of grass and my horse has got the most massive grass belly which I'm trying to get down. So he needs to, he's also got his drink ball which is hence the, the racket which is actually is a piece of ball. This one's been beaten to death as you can see but actually it's really good because it takes them ages to get to eat them. So what we do do is I make him up some really small hay nets. We've got a really good batch of hay this year. So we've got about 56 different hay nets, um, hay bales, which are all in there. So, and we fill quite a few, we fill quite a few barns with them and also give quite a few away. So the grass is cut, which is really, really good. But 56 is, is the slightly smaller bales this year, but they're really good bales. And then what I tend to do is because my horse is super fat at the moment and I need to get his weight down, what I try and do is incentivize him to be off the grass. And sometimes we just bring him in and I get really small hay nets. I've got very little in them, uh, probably about a third full at most sometimes even a quarter and that's plenty of hay for him to get his belly down and what i tend to do is to, to stop the risk of things like laminitis as well i make sure their food is soup so we give them a lot of fluid to make sure that it all passes through and is digested really well so and as i mentioned in my last blog he has turmeric he has uh, garlic he has balancer and some good chaff in there and um, half an apple at most. I tend to give them carrots as opposed to apples to reduce the risk of things like ulcers. Um, I used to put him on gastroid for a long time because he suffered before I got him with um, ulcers in both intestines so it took me a good couple of years to get him through that. Um, things like lots of water, not too many sweet treats, this is herby treats, very rare. Um, but just to kind of um, keep, yeah, keep the sugars out of his diet because ultimately it, it doesn't help their arthritis. There's plenty of sugar in the grass anyway, so that's plenty. So that's what my horse is eating at the moment. Very little because it's even putting him on a, a really bare paddock um, is, is, yeah, 